Hey y'all, welcome um, back to the Saxophone Factory. It has come to my attention that I have not recorded Lesson 12, which is really a problem because Lesson 12 in the Rubank Elementary Method for Saxophone uh, is one of my favorite after it's one of my favorite exercises and it's because it sort of encompasses everything from lesson one through a lesson 11 and um, I had a student in today who said he couldn't find it uh, although some of them are hard to find and and I you know what and getting them in chronological chronological order is not been anything that I've been good at you've already known that I appreciate uh, for people who are joining people who are subscribing to the channel I appreciate it. Again, if, if you're watching this and you have not su subscribed and you like this video, please subscribe and please please hit the notification bell. That way you know when I upload again. All right, uh, we're going to do lesson 12 um, from the Rubank Elementary Method for Saxophone. And uh, we're, we're, we're going to do it all in one piece. Now, you can do it in six different pieces. If you look at the end of every other line, there's a double bar. Um, there, I mean, and everyone's a little different. So you can learn it in six different exercises, or you can play it all at one time. If you play it all at one time, do this for me, please. Set your metronome at 60 and play it all the way through at 60 without any error. And then 10% up, and then try it again. Get it all through, practice it at that tempo with no error. And then 10% more, and try it all again with no error until you get to about a 120. And that should be enough before you move on to lesson 13. All right, how I'm going to do it today, I'm going to just play the whole thing through a little faster than 60. Uh, again, just like always, if for some reason uh, you're playing along and it's too fast for you, stop the video, practice it, and come back to it. Okay? All right, here we go. All right, here we go. One. The remaining exercises are now in the key of F, and they all have B flat. Here we go. Thank you. 
Okay. Now, again, what you can do is you can take these and you can break them up into six different exercises. And um, at that point, again, starting at 60, metronome marking 60, and then increasing the metronome marking about 10% every time. Remember what Pat said, never play anything per faster than you can play it perfectly. That's what your goal is. Your goal is to get to about a 120 and have it be perfect. All right, again, thanks for um, thanks for coming to the Saxophone Factory. And uh, listen, till I see you again, keep practicing.